Do, 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 do. So many choices. Chin strip. Honest Abe. Man's man. Swashbuckler. Ladies man. Tough guy. Look at how many different choices there are. This is just insane. Let's go back up here. What was that one I liked? I don't remember. It's way up here, I think. Was it this one? Let's, uh... Let's go with that for a while. We can always change it. Wadsworth will give us a haircut whenever we want. Okay, and we are done for now. Yes. Tell me a joke. Yeah, the two cannibals are eating a clown. One cannibal turns to the other and asks, Does this taste funny to you? Ha ha, that was lame. My humor emitter array requires recharging. Indeed it does. Okay, that's it. You have yourself a fine day, sir. Thank you. Your weapon is in poor condition and can do more damage if repaired. You can repair items in your Pip-Boy or by visiting a vendor. To repair it yourself, you'll need to use parts from a similar weapon. Thanks for letting me know. All of a sudden, my weapon was in cruddy condition. I don't understand why it just picked that to do that now. But This is a Pip-Boy col- or not a Pip-Boy. Blah. A bobblehead collector stand. And every so often when you click on it, the bobbleheads you have will appear here. You'll still keep your bonuses from whatever you got from them. Uh, now one thing I like to do is see in this house you have all these extra items. None of these are useful at all. So uh, what I like to do is take them all and then go over to Moira's and sell them for uh, money. It's about the most useful re thing to do with them. You can sell all that stuff. Another reason why I do that is because when, once we get some decorations from Moira, uh, it, this place refills with other items, so it's you'll get more to loot, really. Nothing in here. This is a bed. Um, sleeping in this bed will not only heal our stuff but give us a well rested benefit which means we get a bonus to XP for like 12 hours I think it lasts uh, 12 hours game time I mean and uh, we'll get a bonus to experience I think it's 10% bonus to experience for as long as it lasts and the decoration we're gonna get from Moira I don't know if we'll get it right now or not but uh, It'll provide a bed right down here, so we can just walk in the door, sleep, and walk out if we want. Um, let's go ahead. In fact, let's go ahead to Moira's and, uh... Ah, oh, pooey. We'll have to wait till it's daytime. We're gonna go to Moira's and get the, uh, decoration, because I'm pretty sure we can afford it right now. And then we'll come back and unload all of our stuff. Whoops. We'll have to wait like nine hours. Might as well sleep while we're doing it. We'll go get the decoration, then we'll come back to the house and unload all our stuff. And be ready to go do some other side quests outside of Megaton. So let's go do that.
So, how's the scabbing been? Got the food medicine from that super duper mart? I haven't gotten around to it yet. Quit asking me. Oh, well, could you get on that? Thanks. I'll be quiet. I hear you're the person to see about buying stuff from my house. Good to see that old house finally found an owner. I have all sorts of items and themes for that place that may interest you. Uh, let's see, can you tell me what the items do? Of course I can. Which one in particular interests you? I don't know how we know about this without her telling me, but whatever. Tell me about my first infirmary. If you're wounded, or you've hurt one of your limbs badly, this setup will allow you to heal it up as good as any other wasteland doctor. That also heals your radiation, if you're concerned about that. I don't know why she doesn't mention it, but... If you feel like filling your place with a whole bunch of music, switch this beautiful pre-war antique on. Tell me about my first laboratory. This setup is great for experimenting and coming up with all sorts of useful concoctions. It can also be used to get rid of any horrible addictions you may have from tasting your results. Yeah, that's going to be about the last one we get because it's pretty pointless. Um, but we'll have plenty of caps to get it anyway. Tell me about the Nuka-Cola machine. One push of a button and you can get your hands on an ice-cold Nuka-Cola. Ice cold Nuka Colas give more health than regular ones. If you feel like tinkering and want to build some custom gizmos, this setup will help you do it. Yay! That's enough about the items. Sounds good. Tell me about your themes. Some people don't like living in a boring old house. Purchase a theme from me, and I use all of my design abilities to set your place up in the manner you request. You can choose from The Vault, Raider, Wasteland Explorer, Science, Love Machine, or Pre-War Themes. We're going to get the Love Machine one, because it provides the bed right in front of the door. That's about the only reason I'm going to get at it, too. I'm interested in The Vault theme. No, let's... Where is it? Uh, the Love Machine theme. Feeling a bit anxious, are we? Remember, once you buy a theme, you can't sell it back to me. Although you could always purchase a new one. Sounds good to me. Well then, let's make a deal. Okie dokie. Now you'll see that the, uh... Where is it? Where is it? There it is. House Love Machine theme. 1441. We have twice that amount, so we can afford that. Uh, let's go ahead and get that. Oh, wow. I really do need to repair my pistol. Good thing I have a couple others. Haha. -ha. Uh, let's go ahead and get that. Sure. Why not? We can afford it. And uh, to make it cheaper, let's see if we can sell some uh, junk. We can sell that. We can... No, nah, we better keep the buff out. That's for another side quest way later on. Uh, we can sell this cart and the SIGs. Uh, we can sell crispy squirrel stuff. Crunchy stuff. Cutting board. Dinner plate. Empty soda bottle. Fork. Green plate. Uh, Instamash. Metal cooking pan, metal cooking pot. Red plate. Salisbury steak, scotch. Spatula. Mm -hmm. 
whiskey, white plate, yum yum deviled eggs, and we'll keep all the rest of this for now. Like I said, I like to have unique items and, uh, I mean unique clothing and weapons and some of this other junky type stuff is for the, uh, create creatable weapons that you can make later. So we saved some money, now it's only 1139 that we have to pay here. That'll work for now. We're down to 869 caps, but that's alright. Good hunting!